Meanwhile, turning the focus to northeast Missouri now, a new at 10 hospital hospital administrators there say they're seeing what they feared back in March. For example, the CEO of the Scotland County Hospital says that rural health care has been short on workforce for a very long time. What they're facing now, they say only exaggerates that issue. He says the only reason things are working right now is because they've been planning for this since the start. I, I liken it to that 4th of July block of firecrackers that you you want to light the fuse and then have the big finale. You light the fuse and it fizzles and fizzles and everyone looks at one another and nothing's happening and everyone goes and gets their lemonade and popcorn. And when they're not looking, boom, it all goes off. Dr. Tobler says they're working with smaller regional hospitals to offset some patients already, but he says it can be difficult transferring COVID patients as their conditions can get worse and that can happen fast. He says Governor Parson has been involved in helping them secure PPE and rapid testing and we're going to have more on this coming up tomorrow on WGEM News Today. More on how they're working to speed up training for nurses who are in school right now just to expand their workforce.